We are now getting our first look inside a new space lounge set to start taking people to the edge of space in 2024. This thing is incredible. The spaceship Neptune will launch off Florida's space coast and offer a different kind of space flight experience bar and Wi-Fi included. That's the way to travel. Probably expensive too. <laughs> West Coast Kelsey Thord has the details from the Kennedy Space Center. Well, have you ever looked at a space flight and thought, yeah, I would do that if I didn't have to go up in a rocket to get to space? Well, a new space tourism company is doing just that, offering rides to space at a comfortable 12 miles per hour. A more comfortable and more affordable trip to space. That's how the folks at Space Perspective are pitching their new spaceship. If you can ride on a commercial airplane, you can fly on Spaceship Neptune. Jane Pointer is the founder and co-CEO of Space Perspective. She says unlike the other rocket-fueled experiences in the space tourism industry, Spaceship Neptune offers people a much more relaxing journey to the edge of space. When you fly on Spaceship Neptune, you're going to space at a very gentle 12 miles an hour, so there's no G-forces. You're sitting in a space lounge. That space lounge, Pointer says, includes panoramic windows, free Wi-Fi, restrooms, and even a bar. The whole environment is set up to be able to share this experience with people both in the capsule on the flight and on the ground. The journey lasts about six hours using a state-of-the-art space balloon. Two hours rising up, two hovering on the edge of space, and two descending back down, ending in a splashdown in the ocean. Anyone can buy tickets. The price, $125,000 per person. I would definitely sign up for it. I think it's something that we could all use a little perspective on why we're here. Yeah. Definitely sounds really pay, nice. Pay that much Travel money space and you and wouldn't remember a thing. Yeah. <laughs> And I think that space bar has a lot of people intrigued. Space Perspective says demand is out of this world. They say that the first year 2024 is already sold out, but they do still have tickets available for 2025 and beyond if you're interested. In Brevard County, I'm Kelsey Thorne, WESH 2 News.